False. They have become a part of every person's daily routine. We use cell phones everywhere, including work, school, and most recently, cars. But as of June 1st, Rhode Island will put into effect a new hands-free driving law. Under the new law, you cannot use handheld phones to talk or listen while driving. You can talk or listen using hands-free equipment. You cannot text. You can use mapping apps. You cannot email. You can talk using earbuds or through a headset. You cannot put earbuds or earpieces over both ears, but you can use speakerphone. Surfing the internet on your phone? Well, that's still unclear. So as of June 1st, any person in a vehicle using a cell phone will be charged $100. Uh, I would never do that. I've just always learned that it's one of the worst things to do while driving, especially when you're driving like a few ton vehicle. It's just way too dangerous to do so. Oh, whenever I get a text, I usually just answer it with the talk to text. It's about time. I think everybody should have to drive with two hands on the wheel, focused at the business at hand, which is driving, not eating, shaving, fixing their hair, or texting. I think it's a good idea. Um, you know, every other state pretty much is already doing that. Rhode Island is very behind the ball as far as the hands-free law. Um, you, know, you can still be distracted even if your hands aren't on the phone. Uh, that's, you know, another thing we're going to have to tackle sometime in the future. According to state police, traffic deaths on Rhode Island roads spiked 63% last year. 83 deaths in 2017 compared with 51 deaths in 2016. State Police Superintendent Colonel Anna Sampico believes the increase is partly due to phones, although there is no solid proof. I'm Nick Carlson with WWHS-TV.